120th. We are 120th in line. We arrived here around what? Five o'clock? We got a check in by 8.47. Tonight we tried Makia Wagyu Shabu House that just opened in Santa Clara and I took out my lovely wife for her birthday. So their claim to fame here is they have all Wagyu beef. Like, really good stuff from Australia, from Japan. They even got the certificate in, like, the, the front desk area to show you, like, the, their official. It's like their soft opening, and we decided to give it a try. The wait was three hours, like you saw in the beginning of the video. And here's a milk tea bus. Uh was kind of out of order. Actually, it was out of order. Out of all the four slots, there was one that was barely working. So we didn't really get to uh, try the milk tea. We, we could, but it like dripped out. We made it. <laughs> we made it. How many hours? Three hours? Three hour wait. Happy pre-birthday celebration, love. Thank you, thank you. Now we're going to check the manual membership. Once we finally got in, we got to look at the menu. Now there's several tiers. They got silver, they got gold, they got diamond. And diamond is what we rolled with. It's unlimited everything. The diamond Wagyu set comes at comes in at around I think almost a hundred bucks per person. You ever been to Vegas? It's like the same price as Bacchanal, um, but it's all you can eat: the seafood platter, all the A5 Wagyu. That the Japanese food stuff comes in comes included too. It's like unlimited tempura, but we ordered tempura and never came. But the th crazy thing is. Um, as you go and turn the menu, you see the gold set and the silver set. I think with the gold set, there's limited options. Um, silver set, there's limited options. And pretty much, that's pretty self-explanatory. Uh, <laughs> the diamonds, basically, you get unlimited. The bone marrow, the beef tartare, the wagyu nigiri, um, all that all the good stuff, and then here's here's pretty much the layout of Shabu, um, uh, of their of their, I guess you call, call it condiments. I'm not really a big Shabu guy, uh, but walking around this place, it was pretty chill, pretty clean. Uh, you got the drinks there, you got juices, they're great. Uh, they, had, they had like this guava juice it was hella bomb. This is their unlimited ice cream. It's not necessarily Hagen Dazs as some people talked about, uh, but they had decent ice cream. These are all the plates. Um, that the waiters kind of take in, and as you order, uh, they'll keep refilling as much as you want. And then here's where you get your rice. Yeah, this is where the condiments are, my bad, um, and all that. But pretty much, pretty much in. This is our table, kind of stacked it. The bone marrow uh, was so bomb. It was like beef butter, Jesus. And there's a seafood platter. Oh, the broth. I think we got sh we got the shoyu and the house broth. We literally just watched someone eat it today. Beef butter. <laughs> it's like beef butter. That's really good. Huh? We gotta get more of those. All in all, the waiting staff was really great. The service was phenomenal. Uh, they say surface or service. Uh, the service was phenomenal, and the food was bomb. They always refilled our stuff. They always topped it off. But out of a scale of one to ten, as far as experience, I'd say a nine, eight and a half, nine. Um, we had so much food. professional when it comes to Shabu Shabu, so don't judge me how I do it.
We are an hour in. Oh. Tapping out. Almost. I got that much more left. And they replaced these like twice already with several stacks. Three times. <laughs> Trying to make it. We still got ice cream. Mm. We're about to tap out. It's been about an hour. A little over an hour. You have a 90 minute limit. But uh but we still got bone marrow. It's because we got the unlimited bone marrow, so we're getting the bone marrow. Then after we down that, we got the unlimited haagen -Dazs, but the ice cream that I have isn't really haagen -Dazs. What? Oh, you didn't know? It's not? It's like a different brand, I think. What? I think they switched it up. No. But double check, I'll check. Check this out, man. But, uh, but overall, Great experience here so far. The service is great. Food's fucking phenomenal. Um, I mean, the only kicker is that they don't let you grill the Wagyu. Like, you put it in the broth and it still tastes good and all that, but. Uh, Thank you. How's everything? Good? Everything's good. Can I take it? Let's see. Okay, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. You need an extra order for you guys in the broth? Oh no, we're okay with them. We're okay. Sure. Yeah, I appreciate it, man. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So right here, <laughs> barely getting by. This is like eight five wagon. You used to go. This is a ribeye or something. It's really great. But definitely hitting a wall. Brisket yeah. yeah. This is the ribeye, yeah? Yeah. I think the brisket was the one that was all the bomb. But either way, um, it's not heavy. It doesn't feel heavy. It tastes pretty bomb. I'll tell you that. But we are eating a lot. You got it? What do they get? Ube and matcha green tea. There's also mangoes too, but I didn't get it. And are you disappointed that it's not Hagen dazs I am, yes. It's part of the reason why I came here and I was told there was unlimited Hagen dazs Well, I'll take the food. Spoon is in here. Oh, the spoon's inside? Yeah. All right, they got me with the ube. Ube for sure. What's the official review for you? One out of 10, 10 being super awesome, one being not really. Uh, I think it was a solid like nine and a half. Nine yeah. and a half. Yeah, only because I thought they would have Hagen Dazs ice cream, but. Let me see if she can get you. Nope. nope. Only because of what? Oh, they didn't have Hagen Dazs ice cream, which I thought they would. Saddest day. <laughs> but it's okay. They had a little bit of ice cream, which was pretty, pretty solid. <laughs> pretty bomb, cause we got more. <laughs> Gotta get to go. I say nine out of ten. I'm not a shabu shabu guy, but it was, that was really pretty good. good. It was pretty good. Diamond package was pretty worth it. Would I buy? Would you buy come the? Back? Would I come back? I, I, I come back on an occasion, not like. Not just. Not like it's just like oh let's go and eat. <laughs> would you would you buy the four hundred dollar NFT what? membership? No. There you go. Always have it. No. Until next time, <laughs> don't forget to uh, like, subscribe to all the things, and comment below what other places we should eat around Santa Clara, San Jose, San Francisco. Okay, bye.